Okay. Bard's Tale. Thou art in the Guild of Adventurers. We're gonna make ourselves a party. I'm excited. Cat's excited. Everyone's excited. Ryan the Fist. Elsid Marcus. Sir Grady. Okay. That's. That member's already in the party. Okay. So apparently we're picking up Brian the Fist. I feel confident about this. Alright. Marcus. Sir Grady. Oh, wait, I picked up Merlin. And Omar. Oh, no room for Omar. Okay, moving on. It's like the whole thing. So, cancel goes back. Okay, this is old school. It's back when, like, escape was out and sort of like, escape! Um... Can I create a member? I really can. Half elf. What do I have here? I have a bard. Who should we replace? Sir Grady. Please him. Enter the new party member's name. It's a good name, Persephone. Jenkins. We'll put Jenkins in there. Everybody loves Jenkins. Alright, so we're gonna remove. Hold on. Let's not remove. Remove this dude. This dude. Sir Grady. Sweet. We can pull our golden stuff. My oh, dude. Hold on. This interface is non intuitive. I can't believe they had a mouse in the first one. Impressed. Pick the party member. To save to disk and remove from the party. Add member. Put Jenkins in there. Jenkins, yo. You're a first stringer now. Alright, so save the party. Match its Jindra. I'm gonna enter the city now. The old layout. Beyond boss. Hold on. Can we turn? We can. Oh, we have to use the mouse. Scarabray. Dude, isn't that... I face death itself in the form of eight dwarves. My stalwart band shall choose to fight. Um... Party attack. Alright, well. It's a good thing we skipped some of that. Let's just say that. You are apparently allowed to attack yourself. Reasons unknown. Alright, we're rolling with it. Dude, I'm gonna get my butt kicked. I blame Jenkins. Just blame everything on Jenkins. Oh, Jenkins. Everybody is beating up poor Brian the Fist. It's always a paladin. Fry Marcus. Okay. I think we should probably run. <laughs> They're not faring well. Alrighty. Ah, oh, dude! Again? Alright, let's attack foes this time. Just can't. Our choir. Shoot at the kobolds. <sighs> Jenkins. Hey, how come Jenkins can't attack? What's up with that? Making him sit down. Ruin the last one. Sit this one out, curb it. Take care of it. Hey, we took out a cobalt, alright. Feeling good about this. See me rolling. Cast a spell. Alright. Take him on. Take him out. Why would I attack my own party? Like, so lost here. Poor oh, Jenkins. <gasps> Brian the Fist hits for one point of damage. You're not using your fists, are you? How do you even get a name like that? You shouldn't let me talk. I'm assuming he tears it up at bars or something. 
Did he get gold for this? Holy cow, 15 points of damage, he heard me. The things you think when you're a kid. <laughs> they never should have taught me to have imaginary friends. I like felt bad for monsters and video games and stuff. Now I'm a bitter adult. All right, 127 pieces of gold. Found a halberd. Rock on. All right, we're gonna we're gonna get ourselves turned around here. Um, who's my bard? Marcus, can you continue? Firehorn, sweet. All right, what's this place? I see an alcove. It looks like an open door. So, the sudden scream of battle brings the party to a halt. Well, obviously we can take one skeleton, right? Attack foes! Just defend. We don't need you, Merlin. It's gonna be over like, whoa. So apparently, and I think I recall right, you spend like the first eight hours of this game walking around fighting things. Is there a map? Let's look for a map option. I thought that the bard could play. I must be incorrect. I play music and put everyone to sleep. Whoa. Thought that was a side street. I thought incorrectly. In an empty building. I cannot maneuver. Alright. No. Let's turn this way. This is worse than going to the mall. Get lost all the time. Okay. Running around looking for stuff. Ye old shoppy. Okay, I stand before a gate which is guarded by the statue of a samurai warrior. Holy cow. I don't know if I can take this guy. Let's try. Um, cast a spell. Trap zap. Defend. Hide in the shadows. I don't know what that is. Alright. Oh, boom! Taken down like that. Way to go, Marcus. Wait, I thought. Oh, Marcus died. Tragic. I took down the samurai, so it's okay. Did I get through the gate is the real question. I should move Marcus to the back. <laughs> I don't want to fight you, I'm running. No. Pretty Jindra has refused. Dude, there's nothing in this town but empty buildings. I read the angry letter. I mean, I could make all the money in the world just running around like killing people, but there's fun in that, right? Empty buildings, empty buildings. No, I'm not fighting you, magicians. This is not happening for you. So, this is Bard's Tale. Kind of wondering where it got its reputation from. I'm assuming that RP, like hardcore RPGers, found this infinitely more fascinating than I do. I don't want to bash it, but I'm sorry. There's like 16 empty buildings and I can hit things. <laughs> Longest journey move over. So anyways, Bard's Tale 1. It was a throwback. Can't say I'd recommend it to a friend, but thanks for tuning in and watching. Um, my name is Anjindra. You can find me at Anjindra on YouTube.com. I also run a blog, bedfantasyarcs.blogspot.com. As always, let's talk.